Street Car Takeover Bowling Green, and this is episode five of Cletus's Garage. I'm about to drive this year drift car. This will be my first time driving a drift car. A lot of people, I think, are going to be excited because it's an import, but it's got a gosh darn American made bald eagle screwing LS in it. And it's got twin turb skis. I know it's good for about 1100 wheel horsepower. We're going to take it out on the circle track, and I'm going to, I guess, basically. Do some good old drifting like them boys do I've been hearing about on the interweb. We're gonna see what this old 350Z's got. The good news is I got my pit crew changing out to my drift tire. <laughs> Just kidding, this is actually the owner of the car. We made sure to paint every body panel on the car a different color so that people know it's a drift car. If you saw my last two episodes ago, I drove that Sushi GTR, 1100 wheel horsepower GTR. This beat it last night by a couple miles an hour. He's got 62 millimeter turbos on it. Two of them, thankfully. It's got a hydraulic e-brake, which I'm curious to use. I've never really used one. Otherwise, it's got four wheels and a clutch and a brake and a gas pedal, so I think I can drive it. So as you can see, the darn LS was already too fast for this import. The wing ripped off going 150 miles an hour down the interstate. He said it actually sounds like it's falling apart, but I see plenty of rivets here, so I'm confident that the car is going to stay together while we drive it. When I first walked up, I was like, dang, how much horsepower this thing got? I see it's got like 50 stickers on it, which means it's got to be over eight, 900. And then I realized, you know, it's got a 1320 video sticker. And that's a hundred horsepower right there. You hear that? Oh, you hear it. Gosh damn bald eagles coming from that LS engine. Let's go get it. Ready? Here we go. Let it rip. <laughs> okay. Just a second. He did warn us that it could fall apart at any time, or at least <laughs> sounds like it's going to fall apart. You've done this before. I was getting close to it and I was like, no. That's pretty it. impressive. Like a true redneck, we're dipped in a gosh dang 350Z with a twin turbo LS. Dude, this thing is bad at it. Car drives awesome. The power is like always there. You ask for it, it gives it to you. Freaking turns so sharp. Did you see of all the things you decided to drift, it was a trash can? Part. Well, in the trailer part, we got just as many trash cans. So I was like, well, dang, I know how to drift around one of these. Yeah, you can smell the. Bald eagles in those tire marks. That was fun. All right, now we're done. Safety first, kids. Now I'm going for a ride along with the actual driver, which always turns out to be pretty terrifying. So <laughs> we're gonna go have some fun.
gosh darn imports, I tell ya. When you mix the import and the LS, it's a winner. Until next time, watch out for Cleese's Garage, episode six.